All right. Well, time for me to finally get around to doing another draft. Here we have Volition Reigns, and a Cliff, Barrage Ogre for our uncommons. Not the most exciting. Volition Reigns has really been kind of a meh card. Um, nothing really here for in fact, so I guess Shatter is good. Not really passing a whole lot of other stuff. We could take the Perilous Mirror. I do love this card. He's just annoying as hell. I think it really comes down between these two. I mean, Shatter takes care of a lot of more things than Perilous Mirror does, though. So, I guess we'll go Shatter. Um... Second pick, Cyst Bear, is pretty good. I might go into that. Cyst Bear is one of the best poison cards. And we literally cut off poison from this pack. Um, at least with Infect guys. Maybe we'll table an Untamed Might. This card is just stupid. If this card was not in the set, poison would be significantly worse. Um, I rather like red green um, poison. Red gives you your removal that you need. So I don't mind taking a cyst bear here. At worst he's still a, a sweet creature. And, and here's another reason, you know, for being in red. Turn to slag. Turn to slag's retarded good. So we're gonna pick that up. Ooh, arrest. Uh, hard to pass that. It's also contagious name, but not very concerned about that. Also, for gym armor, card's pretty retarded, right? I mean, if you're gonna pass arrest, pretty clear that you're gonna have wide open. So I'm gonna take the arrest and see where that leads us. Mind Slaver, huh? Well, not a whole lot else here. Hmm, maybe we could take the shield. I guess Mind Slaver is good enough. Oops. Tough pick, tough pick. Yeah, I think Mind Slaver is good enough. Um, looks like the poison plan dried up, so I guess we can take the artisan here. Pretty good card for any sort of deck. Uh, yeah, probably still better than this Golem's Warden. Um, man, I guess we'll just take this replica. I don't really see anything else to take. Weird signals. I almost guarantee you we're going to take out the Untamed Might. But I really want to be in red because these shatters and turn to slag. I want to be in white because it's a rest, so... Those are the colors I want to be in. And I just took this because it's a 1-4. Maybe I'll get a mirror. That would be good enough. A uh, clone shell? Ooh, rest or out. Never mind. Okay. Looks like we could be a red-white metal craft. We missed a few picks, but I mean, the first pack is kind of used to figure out where you're supposed to go, right? So we'll take a bleak coat and vampires. Ooh. Trainee, ogre. Hmm. 
and he's pretty sweet. But I'm thinking Barrage Ogre is pretty sweet too. If we pick up a way to pump the trainee, it would just be better. So I think I'm going to go with the Ogre. Just gives us more reach. I'll just take the rebuttal out. For our Mind Slayer, that seems sweet, right? <laughs> Combo. Yeah, poison dried up pretty quick. Oh well. That's quite okay. I mean, the thing is, with poison, you have to you have to know when to jump out. If it's getting past you, it's getting past you, and you know. Took a Cispera out of the poison equation, so I guess that's good, right? This card's retarded. Good. So is Arc Trail, though. Two cards that I both want. This card is very good, though, and I don't see passing that. I mean, it sucks that we're passing Arc Trail, but gosh. Trail's so good. This guy has so much value, though. Uh, at worst, he's a 2 4, and at best, he's making 2 2s. Seems pretty good for limited, right? Bombs removal. Semi bomb. So yeah, hope people don't pick up on the red, but whatever. Dark Steel Axe, Rusted Relic, Prototype Portal. I think I'm gonna go with Dark Steel Axe here. Galvanic Blast, gosh. Considering we just took the Kembo, we need the Axe here. So I'm gonna take the Axe here. The card's pretty good. You really, you really just got to take cards that you need rather than cards that are good for your pick order, you know? I really need, like, small dudes. So, Oriac Replica might be good. Oh, man. It's a solid two drop. I mean, it. He's fine on the ground. I think I'm okay with taking it. Just as a blocker that, you know, makes something smaller and puts a minus one, minus one counter on something. I don't really want a Sun Chaser, even if I am Metalcraft. So, yeah. Two drops are good. Now we get past Ridiculous, in fact. That sucks, but whatever. This might be good if we're playing pretty aggressively. Their hand panic spell bomb might just be better if we're trying to be metal crafty. Don't know how metal crafty we're going to be though, but yeah, maybe Golem would just be better. Yeah, probably. So would Dark Steel Sentinel be better? Do I need another 6 drop? I don't know really how aggressive we are, so maybe Sentinel would just strictly be better. Yeah, he's pretty good. Alright, doesn't look like we're that aggressive anymore. So... I guess we could take this. I'm okay with taking a wall. This card is actually fine. Oh man. Pins might be right here too because of the Kemba though. So I'm going to take Ken uh, the, the pins. So many untamed mites. Um. I really don't see a reason why I take this. It's just a bear. 
I'm not going to play any of the other cards. I'm going to play two pins probably. So I guess a white verse. Good. <sighs> Where is this draft going? Glint Hawk. Bard Battle Gear. We have eight creatures right now. We have very few low drops, but. Not a whole lot that really get hurt by bar barbed battle gear though, so I guess I can take that. Wish I had one of those trainees now. Oh, he didn't listen. Well, sure. Now that I have all these sweet equipments, this will probably be good. <laughs> I think I have, no, I don't know how many low drops I have that are good enough for the Glint Hawk, but I'm still going to take it here. The rest of the relic just keeps looking worse and worse. I'm just going to take a disperse. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Something for a Glint Hawk to pick up. I'm trying to hide this, dang it. This card is retarded good. If you ever get him online, he just doesn't die to anything except turn to slag. I guess he's not out of the picture yet. Well, probably. I don't know. So I got another pack to figure out where the hell this deck is going. Um, why did I just hide? Oh well. I'll figure it out. Never something terrible. Don't ever click here for help. Ever. Because what if you just click here, and you're like, oh, I need some help. Click. And right when you click, your pack shows up. And all of a sudden you pick whatever this is. So don't click there for help. Just a word of advice. Really, I've played with Mindslaver a couple times. When it's good, it's amazing. When it's bad, it's pretty awful. Um, I think Rustic would be welcome here. I mean, Iron Mirror, though, probably need pretty badly. Uh, get gets us to our artisan. All of that. I don't. I don't really see. Has an over rustic though, so that's just an artifact that is extremely good. No, well, we have so many threes. That's probably not gonna make it though. Just hope to draw you and equip you every day. <laughs> Sist bear, press celebration. Warden. Anything else? Well, let's see how many sacrifice effects we have. We have one. And two, three, four. Yeah, probably not going to help uh, happen. So I'm just going to take this two, four. 